Hello everybody, welcome to another weekly vlog and I'd be thinking Rebecca, you're back. I am. I am back, yes. You probably haven't missed me to be quite honest, but Ooh. just let you know I'm back. Um Ooh. basically I haven't vlogged for two weeks. Well I have vlogged. I vlogged like the week after I met Seth and Barker. And then I was just like, no, like my internet was just not having it and it wouldn't upload my weekly vlog, which I was so like fuming about. So I still actually have that vlog, so I think I'm actually going to just try and re upload it. And then the following week I didn't vlog because um, there was a lot of things going off in college. Like, bad, well, not bad, not really bad, but concerning things going off in college and I didn't feel like I wanted to vlog and um, it was like very stressful like I had a lot of eventful days not just college but I don't think I want to actually I, I don't know if I should be talking about this like I think I should actually but um I basically Clay, my mum's watching. <laughs> um, when we, oh, this lad in my class created a group chat, and you actually can't see me because I've got eyes in hang on. This lad created a group chat um, on Facebook. Oh, there we go. And that's my mum in background. And it was like a group chat for like all those like class so that we can get to know each other a little bit more, help each other out if we needed it, and like me talking. So if it was a really an amazing idea, we got along quite a lot with the other people in the group and we like we were fine, like nothing massive happened or anything. And then all of a sudden this lad comes on who he never really actually used to talk in the group chat and he was saying why on earth did you who created this group so we told him and he was like okay why it's a waste of time I was like if you don't like it leave the group chat simple as if you get what I mean and me being the person I am I defended the person who created this group um, and I said like, why you created it and the youth and stuff, excuse my birds. Um, and he called, um, do I swear, I don't think I'm allowed to swear on YouTube. He basically called me a piece of poop um, and I immediately removed him from the group because I'm not having like that behaviour, you get what I mean? Um, so I removed him from the group and nothing else was said after that, we were like talking as normal, the rest of people. The following day at college, me and my friend Angela was walking to our class, to media, and he was there with his mates and we just walked past, we ignored him and we was actually going to the toilet. And he turned around and said very loudly, Why did you remove me from the group? And I didn't answer him, I just went straight into the toilet. Came back out, didn't look, because like, he was on my right hand side and the class was on the left hand side, so I just literally just went to class, like I didn't even see him. And then he was just like talking about me um, very loudly so that everybody could hear. And I just like, I ignored him and I was like, okay, it's just one of them things, he's a man, I'll get over it, we'll be fine tomorrow. And then all the way through that class, he was giving me dirty looks and was talking about my calling me names and was talking about like the book chat, um, like it was stupid that I removed him and I, I was like, okay, ignored him. I did actually... I didn't cry, like I felt that like I was going to and I did have like actually tears in my eyes but I ended up crying class, I cried like after but, um, 
and then nothing else was said. He never came up to me personally. But like in the class he said it like loud so that everybody could hear. Um and then it was fine and then on this happened Wednesday. And on Friday um, we had media from 9 a.m. until 4 p.m. and it was after dinner and our dinner ends at 1 and our tutor gave us an extra 5 minutes um, so we was waiting around for him to open the door and they were just like laughing and joking about this group chat and then they were, they were like our class and then there's like another class literally like amongst amongst our class and he was like they actually had like a fight like they were having like a proper fight um, so this tutor comes out and she's like what's going off I'm moving all this writing this noise what's going off she looked at us because she thought it was us and it wasn't, it was actually like the next door's class and um, their classes two chats we sorted them out and moved them and everything like that and she just came out after that class got moved and it was just our class because we were still waiting for our tutor and she thought it was that what we're doing it it was when we tried to explain it was like no no it wasn't it was but she didn't believe us so she was just like oh okay she walked off and she must have told our tutor because then our tutor came in let us in and she was like right somebody said to me another tutor said to me that um you've been fighting you've been arguing there's something going on and then like no it wasn't us it was actually like the next door's class and he was like, oh, alright then, okay. And then we had to record um, a script um, for a video advert. So we went into like, different practice rooms and stuff. And it was me, Angela, and this lad. And we went in this practice room and our tutor came around just to like, check on how we are, we needed any help and everything like that. And it comes into hours and he was like you're right he was like yes and then i said can i talk to you after class and he goes mm, yeah and i can do and he says i know there's something wrong there's something going off and i was like and i said why like how did you know he's like i just know and i'm like oh okay then strange and then he ended the class and he was like right we finished up today but before you leave, I want to talk to you. I was like, okay. Like, to, to a class, did you say? I was like, oh no. Probably like some kind of homework or more. more. And he they said, I've been speaking to quite a few people about this group chat that's going off. Basically, I want you to delete it, move away from it, because there's been tic tacs and arguing in class and people aren't getting on with people this guy just want you to delete the chat or remove yourself from the chat and I was like alright I'm cool so we did that and um, we've actually deleted the group chat and then he says do you still want to read me? I was like yeah mentioned to this another room and he says I've pretty much nailed it as in like I've already spoken about what you wanted to talk about I was like yes yeah, pretty much then I told him what this guy said to me and he was like, right, that's not on, I'll have a word with him so that happened and obviously I don't know if it's work I mean the book chat isn't there anymore um, and all for the next week, all this week um, it goes okay but it was just like building up and building up all week and then that happened so I felt like yo if you get what I mean and then I basically had like a massive like misunderstanding kind of thing with Taryn 
Now me and Tom are fine, like you're fine, we're talking. We're still best friends and everything like that. Basically, I posted on Facebook um, this long status about friends and how I've met a bunch of friends in college. Um, because in the past I've never had friends who listen to me. Um, or the Tencent C players and the and we were basically a dig at last year when I was at the Tree Farm and um, I was only there a few months and the friends I had there they were Tencent C players and they didn't care with us about that and how to put it in the status and I didn't aim it at anybody like that at all and then Talon pops up on Messenger it's like I've seen your status and I'm very upset about it and I was like okay now I'm not going to get into a lot of details but she basically thinking it was about her and I tried my level best to talk about it saying it wasn't you I promise it was about the crew farm about my previous friends I actually did mention in the status previous friends and it all blew up we, started, we, were, we, were, like, we went in the same room but we were both crying like she was crying at earth and I was crying at and I was shaking it was like and I thought that's it my friendship's gone she's gone we're not gonna ever talk again so my mum was like right we're gonna go over to her she was half an hour away from us so we put the shoes on and went out i didn't actually like my makeup was rubbish because obviously i've been crying i didn't take my glasses because i didn't think about them and we went over there we spoke sorted everything out and now we're fine it was like a whole like massive misunderstanding basically so yeah it was just like it's just been like a very eventful two weeks with college and that so that's mainly why i haven't been here then um and then after we haven't really been doing like anything too much like my results came back and I'm fine, like with my ultrasound and my blood test they came back like positive or clear, passed. Um I went to see Doctor Fat Day on the twenty sixth, which is yes, ten past ten. Do you want five past ten? So um do see about why I'm why I'm not having any periods basically. And so that is my life update summed up basically. My mum's been working. We haven't actually done anything like exciting. Um yesterday we went um to which you're then um which is like ten minutes away from us, ten, fifteen minutes away from us. Um we were like this kind of like a like a garlic kind of thing. It went like massive. And um, I went to with my other BLTV colleagues to film. And that went really well. Um and I think that's it was. Oh, you have a meeting tomorrow about that? Yes, we have a meeting tomorrow at two o'clock. Um because we're gonna like share that for just because of a me filming and then uh, other colleague filming. So that we're gonna like exchange that thing. And like see which we want to keep and what we don't want to keep. We're gonna edit it together and stuff. And um, that's it what we've actually done, what has involved going out of the house. Um, and I think that's actually it. My auntie and Nana have gone away. Um we've gone to Abifa. We went yesterday to Manchester and then we sat no we didn't. We went sat there to Manchester. Um they stayed in the hotel and then they got up and they had the flight at 6am Sunday morning and they didn't get in until like they didn't get to the hotel until like what time? Like, like 12? Yeah, yeah. Just after 12 o'clock um, dinner time so um, yeah I think it's like the first like proper day today that I've woke up at a normal time um, and yeah the, about a, I'll be here for four weeks, we'll come back, is it next Saturday we'll come back? Okay. Next Sunday they'll come back, 
and I'm just like, uh, like, don't pull it out because I can't be <laughs> And then on Wednesday, this coming Wednesday, so in two days, it's another student night. I didn't think we had a true student night, but. No, I can still get that list here. Oh, yeah? No, not the ladies' night. No, we've had a student night. Um, so there's another the that. student night going off this Wednesday. It's 6 p.m. while 10 p.m. Um, me, Mum, and Tam are going. So I'm excited about because I'd yes. <laughs> um, it's at Medwell again, and I'm so excited about that. I'll make sure I vlog more this student time because this year's first student night I didn't vlog. Like bear then. I don't know why. I don't know what occurred to her. But I'm going to make sure I vlog a lot. So that's going to be more of this weekly vlog. So yes, I'm excited about that. Um, and I finish college at like 4 o'clock. So I need to get my book. I think we were going like straight from college. We're going straight from college, weren't we? Uh, what time oh. well, I don't know what time I finished because. One of my two, one of my tutors likes to make sure I stay past four o'clock. Well, it's not like it's not the call I've heard it after. I think I've already got a couple of blocks called. What? Normally, one. Well, so I just do it for a Yeah. So anyway, I need to go because like I've been talking for seventeen minutes. Um. So yeah, I just want to update you on my vlog for two weeks. We haven't really even been doing much. Like I've just been at college. So yeah, college is going great and everything was so good with Taryn, thanks so far and I think everything, fingers crossed, is sorted with college. So yes, that is that. So today we're actually not doing anything, I don't think. So maybe I felt quite Yeah, well yeah, tired in my bedroom. Um, I put some makeup on, like eyeshadow and lipstick. Cause like I've been literally wearing makeup for like a week, and yeah, I'll see you. Um, whilst tidying the bedroom, I do that. Time lapses. I'm sorry about this week of vlog going to be long again, but I don't actually care. If you don't want to watch it? Don't watch it. Also, thank you so much for 300 subscribers. Um, there will be a giveaway coming up um, soon in the next couple of weeks, so look out for the week of vlogs, I'll let you know. And yes, I'm excited to learn See you later, bye. So I thought I would do a haul of what I got from the car boot. I've got to mention again. I went to car boot yesterday. Four pairs of car boot. Um, so we've got some stuff that weren't makeup related. I've already doing a snapchat haul um so i'm not going to show you because everything's upstairs and i really can't bother to go all the way upstairs i just got makeup <laughs> so the first thing we literally saw was literally the second store in stall should you say is this massive um vanity case um for cosmetics and stuff this is actually soap and glow, it says somewhere. 50p, 50p. And this isn't for me, it's for Callum. Um, and I'm showing you this because I'll be giving it around Wednesday. And it is massive. And the whole reason I got all this is because I was video chatting with the other day. And she was saying about her uh, makeup, like she's got like a vanity case from TK Maxx and the zips are broke. So I got her this one. But look how massive that is. And the pattern has just got like. I don't know what pattern. It's like a ridge kind of thing. But it's massive and it is 50p and I thought I'd get it early because. I'm a nice friend. And that was good to see. And then we got a 
We actually got clothes, but I don't get clothes from car boot sales because I just don't believe in it. Like I feel wrong sending shoes, but any of the things I'm all right. Um and there was this woman who was selling yours stuff for cheaper. Yours is very expensive. Um some of it can actually be cheap. Yours is like a plus size clothing but it's also not because it's got from 12 the size size 12 to 32 I think I bought it myself I'm pretty sure it's either 12 or 16 the size anyway this woman was selling yours for 50p I got yours so I got it so first of all we saw this um what? And it's white, and then it just says, let me try and show you, hashtag classy and elegant, yeah, and it's like sequins, I don't know how well the camera's going to pick up the sequins, but obviously it's 16, it was originally £16, but I got it for 50p, um, I am not, a, I'm not a size 20, um, but this looks big, and she says it will fit me, I think it actually is going to fit me quite well. I'm going to probably try them on today, and then, oh, oh no, I dropped something, I don't know where it went, anyway, um, I don't know how I'm going to show you this, but it's this massive long skirt. I can't show sure it is. It's really long skirt anyway. Um, and this was a originally I don't know how much this originally was because she's cut the price malarkey off. But it's quite long. Right? How massive it is. It's like a burnt orange colour. Um, again, not my size but it's big so got them both for 50p each and then this massive bag just con contains a lot of stuff that we got you may be thinking we're childish about this but excuse me we don't actually care look at how cute these plates are like, have you seen them aren't they mint they're basically flower plates and they're just like the best 50p for one, two, three, four, six. We're having this amazing deal. So we have a yellow one, an orange, a green, a blue, uh, a dark blue, a light blue, and then a red. And it's 50p for six. I was like, oh. And it was seven when we first got the year. And then we went around to and he was like, you know what, we're going to get it. <laughs> um, yeah. I don't know why. Yeah, it's bad because we fancied the goblets, don't we? Yeah. It was just, it was just cute. Yeah. And then we've got the leaves. What are the goblets? I've got goblets, yeah. Look, come out of dusty from the lap. Yeah, they are. Yeah. I'm not. Hey, the goblets. The four wine goblets, and they're actually from Asda George. And they must have just bought them and thought, you know what, I don't want them anymore. No, they're not. And how much are they? 50. 50 pounds, yeah. And they're just wearing like plastic wine things and they've got different really cool colours. I think it's good for Christmas. Well, I thought we could keep them for Christmas. These plates and these because my aunt Timmy and I'm like straight. <laughs> not like get drunk because they're like drunk drunk, but they like to have a few um, cocktails. And, and then I got this now it's actually quite funny these two things I'm actually going to give them these for my auntie nana Chris. oh no I mean nana watches these videos uh, I'll tell you not to watch it weekly vlog and she would probably forget anyway if she did see it nana don't watch this part and auntie Dawn, do not watch this Um, I got them I saw these 
and I thought it was amazing. If they don't want them, I'll have it. Because I started them myself, I don't drink wine. It's literally a wine like tumbler, like cup, glass, oh. drink station. Eight pound originally. Eight pound. And it says wine is in wine. A little I laugh a lot. I thought, well, that's actually my auntie, my nana. <laughs> um, so it's this really nice like wine thing. It's straw. I've got them both, so they are originally eight pounds. And again, we've got them for 50 pounds. Oh, they're a pound. 50p, I think. Look, look how mint these are. Honestly, I'm going to give these for Christmas. Yeah. These are um, Christmassy presents that I'm going to give them. So, like I said, they originally eight pound. Um, never. But I got them for 50p, which I think is the best deal. And then we've got one more thing. Yeah, yeah. I got I something down here. And I don't know what I dropped. I don't know. I got a bag of that. And then I've got this game which I've seen loads of YouTubers play. It's called Linky. 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 Linky
anyway. That is what I got at the car boot. My mum didn't actually pick anything up. Did you? No, yeah, then God works. They work for me, really. No, I'll be for out. Have they counted first? Oh, they've only got that perfume already. Oh, that perfume already. I've got that perfume already. Oh, yeah. yeah. What, what brand is it? Pink leather. And it, well, £2 or £2, isn't it? Yeah, £2. Pounds. So yeah. You're all right? That's it because I've been talking for like 20 odd, nearly half an hour. And this week, and it's only Monday. Anyway, bye. How can I say bye bye? Bye. Bye 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 Got them from Palm Man. <laughs> never guess how much you wear. Everyone, welcome to Tuesday's part of this vlog. You're joining me walking to the bus stop to meet my mum. Um, I do have my what's it called? Mini tripod underneath because I'm walking about. <laughs> um, so it's currently 10 o'clock, and my apartment at Doctor says at 10 past 10. So I was just set literally set off about five minutes ago. So gonna meet her there but yes this morning I haven't really done anything actually um I have um put eyeshadow on and lipstick on and then played a game on the phone and then got my clothes on and that's pretty much about it and there's this guy like staring at me <laughs> but I don't actually care to promise yeah, I've got like so many things in my hand. I don't have a bag or a pocket in my phone. So, pocket in my coat. Um, I've got a phone, keys, and this camera. My god. But, yeah, I'll let you know how I've gone on. Um, the doctors were talking about why I haven't had periods in like more than two years. So, that's what I'm doing talking about that <laughs> hopefully we get an answer that we will because it's Dr. Batley and she's a bit you know strange <laughs> but I'm sure we will anyway I'm nearly there so I will talk to you when I come back and I'll get my mum to vlog um, yeah, I'm just meeting her at a bus, bus stop, bus stop, <laughs> bus stop, um, same as like I am tomorrow, I'm now on a main road so please do excuse that, um, basically tomorrow I'm meeting her at the exact same position as well as Thursday and then from now on on Fridays, um, but I have to get the bus because my mum has an extra call on Friday so that's fun so yeah I'm waiting for her now um, so yeah she has an extra call on Friday so I have to actually get the bus um, which is not going to be fun but I'll be getting it at that bus stop behind me because obviously I'm going that way and not over there. So yeah. Come here for my mum now. I'm on this massive busy road. So yeah. Everybody was staring at me but I don't actually care to put on it because like what it is. <sighs> anyway, um this vlog is mainly going to be consist of student night purely because that is the main focus um that's my own party I'm going out because there's like a woman coming up here from and I don't want to be involved 
So I'm back from doctors and I'm just about to put my dinner on um, in the microwave. So whilst I'm doing that, I thought I'll let you know how I went on. I'm just going to bring you this way while the microwave is there so then we can talk whilst I'm doing this. Um, so basically, it went okay. I mean, it wasn't the best experience. Basically, the reason why I'm not having any periods is because um, of my weight. Of my weight, um, that stopped her until she's gave me the pill. Um, to take for 21 days so three weeks but I'm not actually going to take the pill until I think after my holiday because I've said I don't want it to ruin my holiday and I've said I don't want to start my periods whilst I'm on holiday so yeah so the thing is for my dinner I'm having these like, potato skinny things it's like cheese and bacon you put in for three minutes and uh, also I've got a, um, a spare two here which I'm going to put in I could fit six in here um, so yeah it is let's see what time it is right it's 12.15 so I need to charge my phone because when my mum comes back she's already had her dinner out like not out but like in the car um, she is picking me up because we're going to Macaroon for just like talk about like what happened at Charlene and stuff. So yeah, that's that. So the doctor basically just gave me the pill. I need to have two more blood tests, but that for. I'm pretty sure this I'm pretty sure it's Thursday. This Thursday, so joy. Anyway, that's that, so I'll see you when I'm in the car. So just coming out of my meeting now, um, it's 3.50. <laughs> Sorry. Um, and you went, well it wasn't a meeting, I mean like we just went in. Um, to sort out is footage from the show there because me and another colleague filmed um, Shirley and stuff and we were like comparing and stuff. We had a right do because we haven't used apple computers like at college i don't use apple computers uh so like we didn't know like how what to do with them how to copy and all that stuff you just a lot of like annoyance we managed to get my footage onto the computer um so they're gonna have got tapes on as well now yes i wasn't actually going to mention the people's names sorry um so now we're going to after and then james um, he's another colleague, he's like a person who like, knows how to edit and actually knows how to use Apple computer. Um, so he's going to like look at both of our like fil uh, footages, like pick and choose from each one and put it into like one like clip I suppose. Um, when he's next available because he currently works. Um, so it's a bit difficult but it'll be like evenings and stuff I think we're coming. Either Thursday or Friday. Um, to come back and see if anything's done and stuff. And to good. So yeah, that is what we're doing. My mum is going back out um, for one call. No, three calls. Three oh, calls because I'm back at Upton. I'm in Upton. Oh, yeah, three calls. Yeah. Well, I'm not going all the way. They just have to me one call. She can whistle it. Yeah, so three calls. I've had to. 
go up there for one. So, what should we go up there tonight, for? Tonight, um, are you doing beds or teas? So she, she'll be back for like seven. Yeah, Richard's working in town. So I'll be on my own, which I don't mind. You know me. And then we'll get some tea sorted when I'll get in. Yeah. Oh, that car was like. Oh, no, I'm contemplating. Caught that on camera then. So that was what we're doing. So I will see you tomorrow because we're not doing anything. Um, we didn't manage to go to my great nan and obviously because we went to go here. Um, my mum is hopefully meant to be seen her tomorrow morning, obviously I can't because I'm at college but I'm trying to fit her in. We're trying to fit her in, so yeah. We're we not don't... like neglecting her or anything. No, we just have such a busy life sometimes that we can't get anybody, can't even do visiting people. It's work, there's all work, work and play, there's a balance, it's just all work and no play. Work, 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 work. No, 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 work, 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 work. So yeah, we'll see you tomorrow where it'll be a much more exciting vlog because it's student night. Yay! Woo! Discounts. Yay. Sale. Shopping. Tavern. Primark. Primark. What more could you wish for? You can't wish for more than Primark, can you? Yeah. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. I'm blurry. I'm blurry. Don't matter. I owe you a massive, massive apology. So, it is currently Thursday morning and I haven't vlogged at all recently. Basically, yesterday I was going to vlog um, in the morning and then obviously I vlog student night. Wow. That didn't happen with it. I didn't vlog at all because basically I was at college well for and I didn't bring my camera. I didn't bring my camera in there because I thought we were going to go home and get to and then go back to bed well. <laughs> Instead we did it and we ate my mum. She didn't come until like five. But about half four, maybe just a half four, about half four, like that. Um, she was late to do a call. So, I was like, great. Um, so, I didn't bring my camera. So I thought, oh, if I didn't bring my camera, I'd vlog on my phone. And those of me brought a like, Mum brought my like blue bag in there, it's like kind of like medium size, like over the shoulder bag. And he's like, okay, work on my phone. So I basically, um, couldn't find my phone. So yeah, but. I hope you did enjoy yourselves at Student Night. Um, I've got a load of stuff in this massive Primark bag. I will do a haul on this vlog just to make up for it. The thing is, yeah, I booked a taxi this morning. I don't know if she said 8.15 or 8.45 because it's 8.15. I've got 40 minutes. So 8.45. I've got an hour. I don't know which one. So I need to hurry up. Anyway, I'm so sorry about that. I really do apologise for this vlog. It's all over the place. But I will do a, a massive student haul when I get back from college in my Primark bag. Um, also, I have to do my toe. You can't see, but I've got like, a massive like, wad on it. Basically, I've got a, a raw blister and it's like rubbing. So my mum put that over it so then that my shoes didn't like, make it even more worse. I can barely walk on the mouth. So I'm having to get the lift all the time and walk in right so I was actually not going to go to college today but I was like I feel bad for Angela because she's on a girl in class. But like, you know what I'm gonna go, so I may as well. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. So I need to go because like like I said I don't know how long I've got and I need to eat breakfast, get changed, do my hair, put lipstick on and glasses, shoes and get out. So yeah, I'm so sorry. 
really, really, really do apologize for that. Yeah, it's just been all over the place today. But yeah. I will see you at the parade and I'll do a haul on Shoot My Heart. So I'm very excited. Welcome to Friday. Even though I do my make it is near 6 pm. Are you vlog today? Mm. Not rubbish. Well, because I didn't even make a candle roll. In front of your face. It wasn't actually, it was behind. They were behind your face. So, <laughs> that's right. Um, but today I have to been to college. And then we went to Mobby's just to get, well, no, we went to see Great Nanan. Finally. Um, my mum's putting socks on me, so I'm not going to do much of today. I'm just going to put socks on. Um, so, I went to see a good mum on. Oh, um, yeah. And she was, she was actually alright today, to quite an age. Um, and then we went to Morrison straight after that, just to get a few essentials. Did get some makeup. Um, that essential, not work. No. I'll show you them in a minute, and then we find it. Also, my toe is still hurting, I've got it still wrapped up. Um, it's in absolute agony, but thank god I'm not at college until Wednesday, so I can rest it. But I've got this packet from a JD Williams. I thought I'd open it. That is what I'm gonna do for you. So I've got a whip, so I'll start very little style. Oh right. Yeah. Is this more PJs? I think it is more PJs. has like this silly tassel thing which you actually can't see me doing. Hold on. This is the PJ top and it has a unicorn on it and it says Rainbow What? Rainbow Oh my god Rainbow hair don't care Because like true This is a top and then the PJs are so cute like oh look at them we've all got flipping it rainbows on them who does want PJs with rainbows on them so that's all I've got from there so once I've found my makeup things I'll show you those so yeah today we have what have we done we just like did like sound like the coaches just own sounds for like films and stuff um and it went really well to part of Finished early, finished at three. Yeah, three o'clock because it, um, the room where we was in, it was absolutely boiling. And so he's like, you know, let's just go home. So I was like, yeah. Felt excited about the it. I was happy that I got home earlier. I was like, who doesn't want to be in college when it's boiling hot? So yeah, also, like, oh God, that was, you can't see. Stains on my hand from stretching. Just like, I just go around every shop and just like lipstick swatches, all sorts. It's weird. So that's it. 
So I'll show you the makeup in a minute when I find it. Oh, we finally found the makeup. Oh, my mum found it actually. So, first things first, I'm a Lewis. I got the Waterproof Wonderful Mascara with Argan Oil. Packaging. The wonders of my computer. It's like bendy as well. Like pen, 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 pen. Uh, I think it's like seven, eight pounds. Two lipsticks. This I picked up another one of these because these are really, really good. This is the Rimmel Stay Matte Liquid Lip Colour. In pink blue. Which way is it? Right there. And it's in pink blue. So this is the packaging, it's like a really nice like Oh Lonzy Gold. Oh in Duo 7 oh, in Thank you. 